What's up guys? It's Bebe Hey and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, hi, I'm Haley and I'm so happy to have you here today. As you guys saw by the title of today's video, I am filming What's in My Purse, Summer 2021. And if you guys know, these are my OG videos. I literally started YouTube with doing these videos and I'm never gonna stop doing them. I love seeing what other people carry in their purses and I know you guys have been requesting a summer one. So here we are, we are back with another summer purse video and I'm using the same purse as last summer. <laughs> I love this bag so much. It's the Louis Vuitton Favorite PM and I have had this for a few years but it is the best purse. I'm not even kidding. It has been such good quality and I can wear it with every outfit. It's kind of a bummer because Louis Vuitton discontinued this exact bag, but they do have the, I think it's called the Felici, Felici Pochette, and it's very similar to this one. That one also does come with a little like wallet insert. It's really cute, so if you want to check it out, it honestly might even be out of stock. I have no clue. But my best friend, Lauren, she got this bag, I think it was like maybe a month or two ago now, and she got it on the real reel. So you can definitely find it secondhand. Some people have it and are selling it, so that's like a good place that you could check. But I just love the print of this and the size. I'm just really into little purses. I feel like that's super trendy. This bag does come with a crossbody strap and I'll wear that sometimes, but for the most part, I just use the little chain and I wear it like this, but so adorable. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you what I carry in here. It really can't fit a lot, but I try to, you know, put as many things in here as I can. So I'll show you just kind of like how it looks with everything in here. But we're starting off with these right on top. They are my new Ray-Bans and these are the square shape or rectangle shape and I love the style of these. I love that they're the brown gradient and a lot of people are wearing like styles like this. I feel like whenever I wear these, people tell me that I'm bringing back the 70s or just like more of the old school look. And I don't know, I just really love them. And they were recently on sale at Nordstrom. I'll see if they still are, but I'll try to link everything down below for you guys. Then next up, I always carry my phone. This phone case is from Casetify and it's customized with just Bebe all on the back of it. But I love the cases from Casetify just because you can put so many different customizations on them. I have another one that's really cute. You guys have probably seen it, it says Haley on it, but really good quality cases. And then today I have like three things in here. It's my lip combo that I'm wearing. Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lipstick Liner, and I just recently bought this gloss, which you probably already know. It's the Lifter Gloss. And then the other lip combo that I also wear a lot, it's more nude, is the Lipstick in Very Victoria, the Liner in shade Iconic Nude, and then the Lipstick in Stone. I'll write it all in the description box because those are two like really good lip combos. And I also got some comments that this gloss is also great in the shade Pearl. So I might get that one next, but I really like this gloss just because it goes on really smooth. It doesn't feel sticky and it's $6.99. Like you can't beat $6.99 for a gloss. I got it at Target, but love that lifter gloss. And then also I have this perfume. This is the Gucci Bloom Scent. And I got the size like this from Scentbird. There's like a little case that it comes in, but this purse just isn't really big enough to have the case on it. I 
really love this scent though it's very floral and i don't know i just feel like it's perfect for summer but i like to carry perfume with me especially when i'm like sweating a lot in these days <laughs> it's so hot i'm like oh i need some perfume when i'm out and about and then i also have this hand sanitizer this is the raw sugar hand sanitizer this is not focusing very well but it's the eucalyptus and tree no i always say this wrong tea tree scent it honestly smells so good this is my favorite one i was at target i smelled them all and this one was the best but raw sugar is such a good brand they have everything good like bath products uh amazing <laughs> And then I also have a Shout Wipe and Go. I've literally been using these for a few years. This Shout Wipe has probably been in every single what's in my purse because I'm not even kidding. I always have these on hand. They're just great when you get a little stain or even if you get deodorant on your clothes. I feel like these are perfect for wiping that off because sometimes it like doesn't come out that good and you're like, oh, I don't want to just rewash this shirt. <laughs> so these are great for that. And then I have my keys. There is this like bangle part that I have usually on here. Not when I carry little purses though because it doesn't fit. I take it off but I got it on Amazon and it's called the bangle key ring but you can just wear it as a bracelet and I really like it for that. But when I'm not using it I just or when I'm using little purses I just unclip it from here and only use my keys. So just the keys to like my apartment and then my car key and then this um, key ring. Then I have some gum. I recently just got a ton of gum when I was at Target. It's the peppermint one and I had talked about how I bought a lot of gum and was gonna leave one of my gum packs in the car and I had people tell me not to do that because it will get all melty and sticky because it's so hot here in Vegas. If this is your first video watching, I do live in Vegas. <laughs> and I decided that I was not going to leave any in the car, but I do have little gum packs for like every purse. You always need to have like gum or mints or something on hand. There is nothing worse than bad breath. And you never know when you're going to go out and about, get a coffee, you need gum. So I try to have like gum or mints in every bag. And then I have some chapstick. This is the Sun Bum chapstick. And I always like carrying chapstick with me too, just because, especially in summer, I like this one because it has SPF 30 with aloe and vitamin E in it. And my lips do burn a lot. So I've been using this during the day. And then another thing I've been doing is using Aquaphor at night. I started putting it on my ears actually and my lips just in, when they're um, feeling burnt and that has been helping them heal. But I try to wear like SPF chapstick throughout the day. And then I have an extra camera battery. I film all my videos on a Canon G7X and I usually carry that with me too. It doesn't necessarily fit in my purse, but I'll just carry it in my hand and usually I'm filming and vlogging everything anyways, so I don't really put the camera away that much. Um, if I want to be able to carry the camera in this purse, I can fit it. I just can't really bang bing i can't really bring like a big hand sanitizer i probably won't bring like the gloss because these are two of the biggest things but i just try to like carry the camera in my hand there also is a strap that comes with the camera so i can wear it on like my wrist or something but i always make sure to have an extra battery on hand i feel like the g7x batteries die not like super fast, but if you have the camera on for a long time and you're filming like a pretty long clip, then it can die quicker. So I don't know. I just feel like you never know when the camera's going to die and it's the worst feeling when you're filming something and the camera dies and you have no other battery. You're like, dang it, this would have been a perfect moment for the vlog. <laughs> so batteries are always good. I honestly probably should order a couple more because I only have 
too. And then the last thing in this purse is this little wallet. This is the coin purse and I've also had this for quite a few years. I just keep like my cards in here. I do like that it has this little clip though so if I want to I can clip this onto my keys. And this is just nice for if I just want to carry it all together. And then in here, like I mentioned, just cards. And then I have a $100 bill. I like to have some cash on me. There have been times when I feel like I forget my debit card or something just because it'll be like in another purse or I've like been using a different wallet. So it's just nice to have cash for those moments when you're like, oh shoot, I don't have my card. Or Apple Pay, I use that too. <laughs> But that is everything that I have in this little bag. I will definitely try to like link all of it for you. But I just love doing these what's in my purse videos. I know they're kind of random. And I know that some of the stuff I show is the same. But I'm kind of like a creature of habit. When I <laughs> like something, I just keep using it forever and ever. So that's probably why you are seeing this lipstick one year later the shout wipes over and over again but I have gotten a few new things so I thought it'd be fun to just show you what's in this bag and what I have carrying around with me this summer but I hope you guys enjoyed watching it if you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.